Howdy, 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 y'all. Welcome back or welcome to Fort Destiny, episode 22 of Hold Your Own. It is almost midnight, so I wanted to just hang out in this cave and for science, if everything does respawn at midnight still, I mean, I figured instead of running to the second cave, we could just go through this one again before I start recording, like, the actual episode. So I figured I'd bring y'all along with me while we are for science, because this cave has been completely cleared out. I really want to go jump down there and get those spiders. Okay, it's midnight. It's after midnight now. I'm not going to jump down there to get the spider. Maybe it doesn't work if you're in the cave. Let's kind of just walk through for a minute. So I've cleared every hallway. I've got these caves down to like a science now. Which way do we want to go? I don't see anything respawning. But again, if you know, does it maybe not respawn if you're in the cave? Is it no longer midnight? Because that used to be what time everything respawned at. Let me know in the comments below. I'm going to head over to the other cave, and then I will meet y'all back over at the car in front of the stone head so we can try and find the huts today. I hear a chook. Mm, don't hear them often or see them often. Oh, there it is. We opened up the chicken coop. We need a chook to put in it. <gasps> yeah, our first chook. We tranked it, y'all. Don't freak out if you're a chicken lover. It is safe and sound in our pocket. See? Chicken. Oh, sorry. I had to bring you back to that. It was our first chicken trank. <laughs> Headed back to the car, and then I'll meet you over there. What the heck? She is on my fat patio. <laughs> I figured I'd clip that in for you real quick. This actually happened right when I ended the episode, but I'm going to clip it in right before uh, the last scene. She actually walked up on my patty. I have never seen them do that before. They're getting closer. I don't have much in the way of defenses in the game, but maybe we'll open some more of those. I don't even know. I've never played this far, so I'm excited. But yeah, just wanted to show. She's actually creeping in my house. Wow. And that door was shut. Later, y'all. Welcome back. Okay, well, the first part that I recorded of this game, or this episode, was on Friday. It is now... Ooh, what is it? Monday. So it's been a few days. We did come to the stone. I assume this is the stone cairn under the tree. So we now need to find the gravel path. Because it says there's no road to the hut. Find the farm just past the bridge. And then continue south on I-66 until you see a stone cairn under a tree at the side of the road. Follow a faint gravel path into the woods until you see the sandy cove with the huts. So can we find, I mean, that might be a faint gravel path. You can also follow the coastline to get to it. Well, let's go this way, it said. This might not even be the right cairn or cairn under a tree. Oh, nope, nope, we found it. Yay, more quest progression each episode. Okay, let's, oh. Where are you? I don't need you coming into this hut destroying things when I'm coming in. Maybe it's their pet bear. I will protect you, whoever's here. Just please don't shoot me, because I decided to shoot outside your hut before I even introduced myself. Promise I was just thinking of y'all. Okay, so this looks like the hut. So, maybe we need to figure out where we're supposed to be going here. Oh. oh all the things that want to kill us are here. Fantastic. Because this is good monies. Stood my ground. Okay. Yeah, we'll turn that to lion fur in the loom. Can we loot any of this? No. Hello? Oh, Jack! Thanks for meeting me out here. This was once a trading post, a central area where all communities from all the islands could trade from. Since the attack from the militia, it's been abandoned, and the militia have taken over a small fishing village and farm near the bridge. I would like to restore power to this island and fix all communications, but I need you to take out the patrolling guards at the village and farm. Good luck. Okay, so you need to kill five guards at the village and the farm. I keep hitting stinking M. Why is it you can hit M? They can be found near the village and farm by the bridge. In your vehicle, but you can't hit M when you're not in your vehicle. Um, what bridge? Is it this? That looks like a farm and a village. By the arms dealer, maybe? 
Okay, we're here. There isn't another bridge. Yeah, I guess we'll head that way and see if that's what they were talking about. Um, I'd like this to be marked, though, because I... Damn it, why? Please add the ability to hit M and not have to go into your tab, because we're going to all hit it five bajillion times, because you can hit it when you're, like I said, in a boat, in a car, in a helicopter. So why can you not hit it when you're just playing the game? Can we... Oh, garbage bag. Some nails and some chamomile. Anything else here that I can loot? Can we break this stuff? No. Just one lonely garbage bag? Oh, wait. No garbage bag over here. What you got? Sand and chamomile. I don't even want you in my inventory. It's not worth it. I don't see anything else. Okay, let's head back to the vehicle and see if we can't go up to that area and see if that counts as the village near the farm and the bridge. Let's go ahead and get our gun out. We should be parked somewhere. Oh, yeah, right here. So now we need to go north. Also, have I hit these caves up? I told you, it was like days ago. I don't remember. Like, in real life, it was days ago. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, uh, yeah, we had to have. Well, maybe not both. To have that ore on us. Hmm. Maybe yes, both. I don't know. If we're here through tomorrow, then we'll hit them up again in between episodes. If not, then... I'll head home. I think we need to get some more iron, too. We need to get a little bit of that, also. I do love how fast the caves respawn. It is awesome. We are making good progression, I believe. We are, you know, one quest and some looting or other stuff each episode. I'm not dragging it out. Okay, there's a farm and a village. So let's go turn around. Like my car to always face the way I need to go when it's time to leave as soon as I can learn how to drive again. Just like that. Just the way you are. Okay, I don't know why that popped in my head. Don't judge. Oh, I hear him. Oh, hi. Oh, I still haven't made my stinking bulletproof vest, have I? Nope. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. They get new sounds in there with their weapons. I don't think I've ever heard the sliding. Like the reloading sound. Okay, let's bandage up for a minute. We got two guards down. Any more this way? I don't see any more. This is that farm area we were at not long ago because we, uh, Throw our torches down over there because we need more inventory room. Oh, there's one up there, but you can be one of those stupid ones that I can't shoot in the head. Nope. Good stuff. I know people hate the pistol in this game. I love the pistol. I think the pistol is fantastic. I have headshot more things. Oh, there's more over there. With the pistol, then... You are one tough cookie. Yeah, they're running. I know, I know, I know. Uh, oh, so many. Oh, my, I need cover. Oh, I need cover. I know, I'm shooting. Well, I'm... Okay, cover. Oh, come on, heal. I'm hitting the button. It's just like, yeah, I know you're still shooting at me. Heal. Let's run away for a moment. Oh, they're still chasing. Oh, wow. Not turning around till I've healed. I'm not dying here. We've died twice. I'm not dying again. We finally got our health up to 142. Let's go away. Oh, man. They're also pretty quick. Yeah, you're scattering. There isn't really anywhere to get cover here is the problem. Okay, well, we completed the quest. Now we just gotta kill all these other things that are trying to kill us. 
get back and heal again. I like that they strategically split up, though. Okay, where did the rest of you go? Also, I want my loot. It's my loot. I earned it. There should be like three more of them, right? Do they run back to their, like, spawn point? Because there was a lot more than that. There's five of them coming at us at once. I don't want to go back and then he's like, okay, well now there's more. Go kill. Well, I mean, he might still say, go kill 20 more. You never know. Oh, I see one over there. I think. Do I? No. It just appeared like there was somebody there. I think we might have done. I swear there was three more that broke away. Let's run down here and make sure they didn't go back to their original spawn because uh, we want to kill them all. Let's go ahead and get us some water. So we need plastic and plastic badly, so we might as well eat that up. Um, we need to put these in the fridge. We only have an hour and a half until they start spoiling, and that's expensive to have it spoil. Let's eat one of each. Yeah, we're going to go home after we talk to Jack again. Get that stuff in the fridge. Take a couple with us, but... Oh. Saving spike. Maybe we did it. Oh, what do we have on us? Anything to sell? Oh, a couple of things. Not really enough to go all the way over there. Oh, she is just right here. I mean, we might as well pop in and be like, Hello, Julia, again. Dropping a couple of things off with you. To free up more inventory space. No, these are not militias that we killed. Unless you don't like the militia too. Which I don't think she don't does. Oh, me. God, that scared me. Oh, I hate when you scare the crap out of me. It's rude. And we really need to go home and get our bulletproof vest made. Will you respond day? No. Julia! You can have that. And that. And these. And some... Tea leaves. What else? You're not getting much hook. I think that's all. Uh, no, you can actually have these. We have plenty of them at home. We also have plenty of Kevlar. Eh, no. Apparently we've been here recently because she has not restocked. Let's go ahead and take another military chest. Uh, we got the AK receiver and we got the AK stock, I believe. We just gotta get like the barrel. I need to look when we go home. So I never remember. Oh, yeah. I'm quite happy with that. Thank you, Julia. Okay, let's go get the vehicle. And then let us head back to Jack to turn in that quest. So we need to let him know. We cleared out the town. They are free to open trade again. Making moves and doing things. That's how we do it. Also, we got to find our car because we ran away from it. And it should be right down here, yeah. Oh, it's a sign moving. I was like, what is crawling across the road? Oh my goodness, my eyes are playing tricks on me today. Jeepers creepers. Where'd you get those peepers? I'm also in a very, very random mood. It's the cold and flu medicine. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. Is there stuff I need? There is stuff I needed to sell in here. We'll worry about that later. We are saving for the helipad, which you do make in the metalworking bench. I remember seeing that, uh, like, two or three episodes, whatever episode we made the workshop bench in. The metalworker bench said it was for the helipad. So that is good stuff. I wish they would mark all the secret areas that we need to remember. Because if I have to come back here, I'm going to have to refer back to an episode. I feel like I'm going too far. Did we pass the, the tree? Perhaps, but we just need to run over there anyway. Alright, let's go let Jack know. We did your request, Jack. Hope you are happy. We went and murdered these evil, evil militia. I think we gotta level up too. Then we're gonna head home, depending on what he tells us to do next. I don't want to progress too much quest in one episode. I like to just do one or two pieces of it per episode. 
Um, but I do want to head home and make the, I almost said the straight jacket, the chest armor. That is great news, Max. You're a real pro. I knew you would come through like you always do. Now that those guards are out of the way, I can begin repairs to the island. Start by providing me with 20 titanium ingots and 10 aluminum plates. I will repair the faulty wind turbines and get power going. You can find titaniums in caves on uh, Congleda. So you are going to be conjugal. Mm -hmm. See you soon. I don't know why that's what I'm picking, but since we, we have renamed all the islands to our own names that we actually can pronounce. Oh, I see more trash. Anything good in here? Don't worry, Jack. I'll clean up your trashy mess instead of throwing it away. Remember when Hold Your Own had, like, backpacks and little trash bags that you could pick up all throughout the world? Did you all play it back then? I did. That was a long, long time ago, but that was, like, the best way to get loot. Because it did not used to respawn, and, uh, but you would run around the world. But it felt more like subsistence to me than... Because then, you know, that's how kind of that game. I don't know. I prefer this one over subsistence. I do like subsistence, but definitely hold your own. I feel like has more sustenance in it. That's just my opinion, though. Uh, so we need to go to our boat, which is going to be over here. So we need to turn around, bright eyes, and go back. Okay, let me get back to the boat and back to our home. And then I will bring y'all back. Okay, we are home emptying out our inventory. Thank you very much to the two people that told me you can make copper wire on the workbench. Because we have all the copper. I just somehow missed that. I apologize. Uh, let's get this all finished up. Because we need more electrical parts. Uh, so we need some more cobalt bars. We got some more cooking now. So let's do electrical parts. Uh, 49. Maybe we'll do like... I mean, we need them for a lot of stuff, but let's do like 35 right now. Just to get it started. Nails, screws, scrap metal goes over there. Uh, I guess you could take that too, because that's where we're really using it at. Uh, that needs to go in the sail bin. This goes over here. We do have the 40 concrete fertilizer now for once we get to that quest. Bullets go over here. That needs to be sold. You already stacked. Fish oil. That needs to get put up. That goes in there. Flour goes next door. That goes out. Okay, I think that is... Oh, no. We are making a bunch of stuff over here right now. Like, a bunch. <laughs> I didn't realize it was um, stalled on the magnesium powder because there wasn't enough spaces to put it all. So let's make sure that is empty so everything can get put in once it gets done. Uh, flour and berries. We need to check on the power in the generator too. Make sure that's good. That's raw. Uh, no, no, no. You go in there. Flour and salt. We also need to make the chicken coop real quick so we can get that chook put in there. Uh, you go in here and let's go ahead and make sure we have a full stack of those. Okay, so chicken coop. We should have all the stuff for. Should have honestly pre-made it, but I didn't. And then the pig hut. Let's go ahead and get that crafted too, just so that we're ready with it when it, it's time. This goes out here in the sail bin. I think we've got everything off the ship now. Is there anything in the car? Oh, it's loaded. Okay. We're actually going to be selling all these tins for right now, just because why not? We have plenty. We can make more. I'm not too concerned. Uh, cloth, eggs. I thought we emptied that out last time. I apologize. We also need to make our better armor, and we actually need to make, like, warm armor, which I don't think we've opened up yet, so we need to do that for the Conjugal Island, since that is where we have to go next for the quest line, and you know, every episode, quest line time. I feel like it's not, we're not powering through it, like, super, super fast, but we're not taking... 10 episodes to achieve one small thing, and that's kind of what my goal has been the whole series, so I am enjoying the ride, but not trying to make y'all lose interest, because it's taking us so long to do anything. Okay, let's put these electrical parts in here. I just want one to stay honest. I want to always have space for electrical parts honest, no matter what, since we need them so often. We've got four and a half minutes left on those. Two and a half minutes left on those. Let's see... We got two points. We do need... So, is the winter coat or the fur coat better? I wish it would say. Um, 
I would assume the fur coat would be better than the winter coat, right? Okay, let's look at what it takes to make. Maybe that will help us. Oh, it will tell us right here. Also, we need to make the chest armor. So, fabric, aluminum, and Kevlar. Let's get that done, too. Since we keep getting told, make chest armor. Fabric, uh, and what was it? Iron bars? Or was it aluminum bars? I don't even remember now. But chest armor. It was aluminum. I'm a goofy goober. Yeah, you're a goofy goober. Not that we're going to be able to wear it over there. Okay, so the fur coat is going to give us plus two armor and increase our body heat. Whereas the winter coat is going to give us plus two armor, increasing body heat. And we also need snow pants. So let's get the snow. I keep hitting all the wrong buttons. Okay, let's get snow pants going. We are going to go prepared. Is there a spot for... Okay. That's shoes. I guess, yeah, we maybe can put armor on and a jacket. That might be the jacket spot. I don't know. And this will tell us how much heat resistance we're going to have. So I just don't know. It looks like they do the same thing. Plus two armor and increasing body heat. But it doesn't tell us how much body heat it's going to increase. Do we have snow boots or is it just military boots are the best? Six armor. Never mining helmet. Plus two armor. Yeah, I just don't know. We can do either. That looks warmer. Doesn't it? Yeah, we're going to go with a fur coat. Let's open that up. It just looks like it would be better. I mean, we could open both, but... Uh, and then we also need to be able to craft... Not the helipad, not the turbine machine. Um... Hold on, let's make these things before I forget. So we want the... What does a crocodile jacket do? Plus two, it doesn't tell you. Hopefully he adds for it actually tells you what you're getting for heat add-on. So we need lion fur, and we already have that. So, fur coat. So we got chest armor, fur coat, snow pants, military boots. Okay, looking good. Looking good. Oh, that doesn't go in there. In the neighborhood. Also, we need more aluminum plates. Uh, oh, no. We needed those iron beams. We didn't get those done. Let's get that. It was, what, four? I think it was four. Let's go look real quick. And then we can pick what we want to use our other point on. Um, it was the furniture bench. Yeah, it was four. We have everything else. I'll just need to bring screws over. So the metal machine will give us the helipad and the furnace. That is where I want to go next is the furnace so that we can smelt the titanium. Otherwise, the whole thing is going to be pointless. So we're going to need 25 steel plates, 25 electrical parts, 50 screws, and cobalt plates. Okay, so let's go here and let's do... Oh, we've already learned the metal machine. Convenient. Repair bench, we've also already learned. So we have the turbine machine. Yeah, I guess that's... Oh, turbine schematic. We're not there yet, so we might as well wait to get that. Okay, so I just need to go grab... Uh, yeah, we have plenty to make more steel plates. Screws. And then... More screws, steel plates, and coal... But, okay. Not that I'm going to remember all that. But I'll try. There's that. Five seconds on that. Uh, there's some screws. We need to make some more. Screw mold. Need more iron fragments. Let's go ahead and make me more screws there. I need that and cobalt plates. I think I had some more cobalt plates. Maybe not. I thought we did. Perhaps we did not. Okay, so what else? Oh, we needed the electrical parts. Fantastic. Those are done. 70 more. Okay, so you and you and you and you and all these screws. Okay, so a furniture bench we could do, but we... Oh, we need more steel plates. We need a what? We have 25. We need 40. We have 21, so we need like... Oh, and our chest armor is done. So let's get that put on. So now we have 22 armor, 10 heat.
Let's see. Iron ingots go in there, and then steel plates. We can make 16 more. We need more cobalt alloy, which we got that going here. So let's do 10 more of those. I am going to have to do cave runs again, but I'm, I'm fine with that. Chicken coop. Let's get you. These are going to get moved, but for right now, I'm actually okay with them just being up here. So let's put you in here. There we go. Grab our milk. 19 milk. We got some level 3s and a level 2 cow now. So we should be able to make some more of those stews we need. The meat stew. We can make five more of those, which is fantastic. I'm not going to put the snow pants on yet because I think that would be silly. So was it just the steel plates? That we were lacking. I know. I keep going back. I need to put a door in here. So I can just go out that way. But this is going to be all furniture areas and such soon. I think we got everything for the repair table though. Or the furniture bench. Yeah. Because we... No available power. It just said it was powered. Did I run out of gas? Didn't that just say power? No, we still have plenty of gas. Maybe we need a second generator. I swear that just said power on. Or did it say no power and I'm just blind? Okay, second generator. Let's just double check it one more time. I know, I know the back and forth. I'm sorry. Yeah, I think we need... I swear that said power the other day though. Maybe it's too far. Also, we need to start putting these in here because we are going to be moving storage into this area. I just don't know where I want to... Maybe the back wall will be our storage wall. We can move those also. Okay. What did we need for a generator? Aluminum plates, steel plates, screws, and electrical parts. I really would rather have the turbine, but I guess for now... Can I move the generator over here? It's only powering the refrigerator. So I think I can move it to that side and it might still be okay. Um, let's move you. I don't know. We're just for sizing this. So I could also move the cement mixer over to here. Uh, let's put you right there. No power. Or do I need the turbine to run this? It's on. Ah, power on. Uh, furniture bench. One. Craft. Okay. Metal machine. So we need to get the... We have those. We have those. We just get the steel plates. And then we'll be able to make the metal machine also. Okay. Those should be coming up pretty quickly. Making moves. 46 seconds. We'll do that before we end the episode. And then, uh, what else can we... Five minutes on those. <clears throat> we had more tomatoes too, didn't we? No, we only had two. We needed three. And then next episode, we're heading to Conjugal Island. Look for titanium and hopefully not freeze our tail feathers off. Do I want to bring coffee? Might as well. And do we want to buy another vehicle? Because we're going to probably be spending a lot of time there mining titanium. So yeah, we need to go to the mechanic and get another ride that we can leave over there. We'll get the 4x4. That feels like a good place to put a 4x4 in the wintry biome. Okay, then we can see what we need for the furnace and grind that stuff out. So metal machine. What am I missing? Need 25, have 77. Need 10, have 12. Need 25, have 22. Oh, no. Okay, well. That might be. Oh, uh, no, we weren't out of that. We were out of cobalt alloy. 
Uh, we can always start. No, I want to start the next episode on the new island. So let me cut away, let these finish up, and then I'll bring y'all back. Okay, we got our furniture bench done, and we have... See, I'm, somebody told me I had to put four metal foundations down to set the workshop on for um, me to place the workbenches in it. So far, it's not requiring that. So we'll see maybe some of the other, maybe the turbine bench or something requires that. I am not sure. Let's put the furniture bench right here so I can put a mil military chest in between. Our metal work machine is now also done. Yeah, see, it's allowing that too. So I'm not sure... Maybe because we placed it on water? I have no idea. Let's put you right here. Let's look on the furniture bench. We got bookcases and cabinets and chairs and couches and tables. Ooh, kitchen cabinet. We've been wanting that. Leather chairs, rugs, and tables. Oh, fancy. And our furnace. That's the next thing we want to get to. Uh, we got to unlock the mineral extractor. We have to get the thingy for the reactor. Oh, there's the freezer. We were told it's better than the fridge. There we go. So screws... Aluminum plates, cobalt alloy, and steel plates. Just a lot more iron and cobalt grind. That's all we need for that, which that's easy peasy. Uh, let's go ahead and put the screws there. Um, can we make that kitchen cabinet nails? Yeah, let's get that made up. I uh, probably won't stick around for it because we are about to end the episode and head over to um, Conjugal Island. Or conglomerate. We'll call it conglomerate island, so it's not so not PG. Um, let's get you made. Uh, rugs and... Oh, this is going to make it so much more fun doing our house. I'm excited. Hold your own, y'all. we got big changes happening. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And as always, before I go, remember when gaming, have fun, play hard, but in real life, be the change you want to see in the world. Later, y'all.